all right hello everyone welcome to another bicycle vlog um i'm actually running to the uh the uh, store right now and um i'm hoping it doesn't rain it's supposed to have it's supposed to it's supposed to rain actually right now and there's a uh there's a 50 percent chance of rain at this hour so um i just wanted to make a quick bicycle vlog before it rains um, I just wanted to talk about the updates with um, the virus right now. Um, I just wanted to update anything that's uh, that's happening with with Japan and um, the virus. And so it's not looking too great. Um, we are on a a lockdown, but it doesn't feel. I don't know if you technically call it a lockdown because it's not really um, a lockdown because there are businesses that are still open. Um, I think I think restaurants are still open um, and they can't serve alcohol. Um, but you know, a lot of other stores are closed. I think retail stores are closed. But I was supposed to come out. I was going to check actually yesterday, but it was raining. Um, today is Sunday, and yesterday. I usually go out and make videos but um it was raining so and today I wanted to go out but it's, it was also it's also going to rain so I think I'm gonna go out tomorrow and then check and see if there's anything um, if there's any uh, any stores that are opened so so yeah um, so right now um you probably know like uh the uh the indian uh in, in india there's um a lot of uh just terrible stuff happening over there um a lot of infections and a lot of uh rising cases and deaths um but they said that they found actually the indian variant in japan in tokyo from a woman from an Indian lady and I believe that uh, she was um, released so they they did she was p positive and then she did like a 14-day quarantine and then she was released but they say that there's uh, only 20 cases of the Indian variant found as of now so um, it, I mean even if they found 20 20 cases i feel like that could spread easily because they're saying that the new um new variant the, in, the indian variant is very uh, contagious um but they haven't found a lot of the cases in the increasing cases recently and right now um osaka is actually breaking um records number number of um cases hold on Oh, it's raining. Hold on. I think I gotta stop this video. Get the umbrella. All right, so I got my umbrella. I should have got a bigger one, but um, it's probably not the best time to be going to the store. But I've been getting kind of stir crazy um, just being stuck at home. And recently, I've been unemployed, so I haven't been really doing been doing a lot of things, but just staying home because of this coronavirus and how there's so many um, cases right now in Osaka, and so. Yeah, Osaka has been breaking number records um, anywhere from 1,000 to 1,200 and um, a week ago Tokyo was about four, four to 500 and people were saying that they're going to hit a thousand as well like Osaka and it has so now Tokyo is, in, um, is, is up at like a thousand now and uh, this they're talking about extending the uh, the state of emergency actually the in Osaka so it's supposed to finish May 11th which is kind of like the end of the holiday there's a week-long holiday called Golden Week that started this weekend so um, uh, so yeah so they were just they were just uh, what also with the increasing uh, increase of infections they're also worried that people were gonna go out more um, during the holidays so they've um, put this uh, restriction for the major cities in Japan 
and uh, they're, they're talking about even um, extending it because you know the the the, infection, the rising number of infection hasn't decreased. Um, there are all there are like um, a, a multiple stories of um, of especially like in Tokyo, and like they were saying like this one kindergarten, all the um, there were like, I don't know, there were like 27 people that got infected and a lot of them were children and the teachers. And there were five, either there were five different variants or it was the fifth case. But I think it was five different variants, maybe. But yeah, a lot of this, um, the, the different variants are starting to spread throughout Japan. And um, a lot of people are catching the, the virus actually. Um, my, my girlfriend also was saying, I think she was talking about the lady that I was just talking about how there was the Indian, uh, the Indian variant in, in Japan. Let me just put my camera higher. Um, and my girlfriend was saying that, uh, she heard this story also too in the news and, um, I was reading this morning too. They are, they're, they are actually still letting people in, and they have been. They've been letting people in for a while now, but they, they're under circum um, conditions. It's not like they just they were just letting everybody in. But um, oh, oh my gosh, ah! they were um, they were telling people to basically they have to. They, um, I think I've I saw this too before that um, they had to take a take a test before coming in and after and then after that they're supposed to do a 14 day quarantine but the problem is um i forget how many oh my gosh look at my umbrella i like this one because it flips in and out if it's too windy this one is from uniqlo actually and i got it for 10 bucks and i've and it's been lasting for a long time because i always break umbrellas because i'm doing stupid stuff like this um oh Sorry, I think it stopped raining. All right, forget that. Oh my goodness, okay. All right. <laughs> All right, so, uh, this crop circle. Um, yeah, sometimes I get really distracted. Uh, so yeah, so there, they are, they were letting people in. It wasn't like a complete ban, but um, <clears throat> the problem was that the people weren't quarantining. I don't know if that's the word, quarantining. They weren't. Um, they were leaving their 14-day quarantine, and um, th and that that was causing a big issue. And um, they're talking about like now doing some sort of digitalized um, like watch or something like that. Or they were saying that the the people have to like do Skype videos to make sure that they're, they're they are where they're supposed to be at. Let me just wipe this water. All right, it's getting wet again. Oh my goodness. Yeah, plus the weather and and the uh, and infections. I've been kind of getting stir crazy in the house. I kind of want to get out, so I shouldn't be really out. But I want to make videos for this week. And uh, you know, usually I go out on Saturdays and Sundays, but it's it's been terrible weather. And I think tomorrow is going to be a little bit sunny. So um, if you regularly watch my videos, please look out for those videos. Um, Cause they'll be coming. Anyways, it's still wet. <clears throat> so that's just kind of what's happening right now. Um, it's basically like there's a bunch of infections everywhere, and uh, you know I think the government's trying to um, you know really put a bandaid on things. Um, and it's kind of like teeter-tottering with like uh, infections and um, how to keep the country still running. And uh, they're saying like even in Tokyo, I remember like a week or two ago that the uh, Osaka Osaka hospital beds they were they were um, they were um, they were over capacity. Oh, oh my gosh! They're over. How's that guy running over there? It was over capacity. And um, right now in Tokyo, <clears throat> the beds for um, <clears throat> for uh, for coronavirus patients it's it's up to like people that are critically ill. <clears throat> it's like they're like 98 percent 
full and then people who are like just moderately ill they're like 78 i'm just i'm just uh, I, I i these these are not the exact numbers because i can't remember exactly but it was around like 70 77 78 percent so they are that's that's like the biggest issue i believe because they, they don't want to have they don't want to have uh packed hospitals um and they're trying to relieve that by um putting through these um these measures of restrictions so um yeah that's what's happening this car's so cool uh, all right um i think that's about it um as far as olympics go so the the players are I, I don't know if all of the players are here, but there are um, athletes here. I, I, I don't know if it's 100%, but um, I think they're going to... I, I said last week that they're going to cancel the... Uh, what I think was they're going to cancel the games, but I really believe um, now that they're going to... It looks like they really want to push through with this, so they might have something like a um like a bubble like the nba did like what the nba did for the the finals last year or like just have it where there's like no events i mean no um spectators in the events or they could even have a possible like vaccine you know like if you're a vaccine you can uh you can come to the games but i mean again like what i was saying uh, um last week too like if you don't have a uh, remedy for the uh situation it's it's it, besides just like staying home and not going out um i don't think it's it's going to work so um there hasn't been any kind of uh new thing on vaccines whether they'll be coming out earlier or they have more um more stock but uh it just th that that scenario it just seems like it's just uh, it's just the same now. Um, people are just waiting for the vaccine. Uh, you know what I? You know, like in America, they um, they were uh, they were talking about people who are stealing, not stealing, but giving the vaccines that were like um, like like people make appointments and they, they can't make them and they have to throw out the the vaccines and they're just giving them to their family members, um, which some people were angry with. But I I think. You know, if you're going to throw them away, why, might as well use them. But they had the same similar situation in Japan where they had like, I, I forget how many um, vials of vaccine, but they had a lot. And they just kind of threw it away because people canceled their, um, people uh, canceled their appointments. And uh, a lot of people were like angry, like, well, wh why just throw them away when, when you can use them? So, um, so they kind of wasted a lot of vaccines um recently well let me get through here they put these guards so i think maybe like scooters can't come through here and people can walk through them all right so yeah i'm gonna make another video right now I'm going to this um this newly built eon mall that they made recently because um i want to buy stuff um but um everything's closed so they got a foreigner store in here so um and they have a huge grocery store so maybe i can find something in this store so please look out for that video but um yeah i just wanted to update you guys on um you know just play by play of what what's happening here and um you know anything any new updates i'd like to update you guys um yeah I, for as far as travel goes um it's i i don't i just don't i don't see it happening this year yeah i just i mean in america it looks like things are like running like normal because um i was i you know i, I look through like instagram i look at all my friends and they're all like at events with no masks like i'm like how is this possible they're like in like big events with no masks. And I feel like it's kind of like in America, it's like, oh, see my son. Um, in America, it just seems like, like, okay, you're, you guys are not gonna listen. 
you don't want to wear the mask well take the vaccines and then like they're just like pushing all the vaccines and now everyone's like you know i think half half of america are, are va vaccinated now so people are kind of like they just it seems like they're just kind of um like done with the virus and now they're they're on to their normal lives so it's crazy how it's it's just so crazy how i, I when i'm looking at friends um um social media it's like people are at events like so many people with no masks it's it's really crazy but um hopefully uh you know we can get there you know at least like maybe at the end of this year at the end of this year or even the beginning of next year um and hopefully people can get vaccinated and and move on with with their lives so um yeah so i just wanted to update you guys um i've been kind of lagging on the youtube videos i mean i haven't been lagging like uploading them but i just feel like mentally i haven't really been in there but um you know i i'm I, sometimes i just get on like um a drought see like if you can see that grocery store is open but these smaller stores are all closed the bento station the toshiba i don't know if you can see it's kind of far it's the toshiba uh store so um yeah i'm gonna go to the ia mall right down there and uh see how that goes but um yeah i just uh if you guys are subscribed if you guys are the normal people that come to my channels i feel like the people that that um are subscribed that are watching these you know weekly or daily um I, I feel like i feel like these updates are more for you guys um and uh, i just want to you know because i know you guys are really curious about what's happening here and i just want to give you like the uh boots on the ground information but um i, I just want to thank you guys for watching my videos and um you know i i'm going to continue to try to be better and 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 make better videos in the future and um yeah i just want to thank you guys for sticking around and you know um hopefully we can get th through this together and i mean hopefully i can get to 1000 k so i can um start um live streaming videos i really want to do some of that um but um i just want to thank you guys for sticking around through all these videos and um and just watching them and and for your support so um yeah and see this this store is like a health like a pharmaceutical health and beauty store and it's it's open so yeah so thank you for watching and um see you guys later goodbye